The Stanford uh, Blood Center and the San Jose Sharks teamed up to offer an incentive to fans to donate blood. KBX 5's John Ramos has that story. They've been holding an annual blood drive here at the SAP Center in San Jose for more than 15 years, but today's event came at a time of unprecedented need. We should see about 250 to 235 donors today. The average blood drive is probably closer to 30, so this is a big one. It wouldn't be the first time that blood was shed in a hockey arena, but today's was for a good cause. Sharks fans were asked to donate at a time when the entire country is suffering an acute blood shortage, according to event organizer Elisa Manzanares. We tell people, you know, if you're healthy and well and able, come on in. We really, really need you. And we've been in and out of critical a lot. I don't know any other way to put that. And even last week, I was putting emergency last minute blood drives on to try and bring more in. She says COVID has prevented a lot of blood drives at local schools and businesses. And as a result, hospitals are beginning to postpone or cancel surgeries, especially elective ones. So they love seeing Stefan Rosner show up to donate. He has a special universal blood that is so clean it can be used by prematurely born babies. He enjoys donating, but admits he traveled to San Jose this morning because of his love of sports. And they're offering to raffle off something like 70 pairs of tickets to a, a hockey game, for a Sharks game, so I'm kind of excited about that. In addition to the 70 pairs of tickets, six lucky donors will win a grand prize of seeing a game in a luxury suite. And while that may have attracted some diehard fans, it also brought out diehard donors like Debbie Teasley. She's given more than five gallons of blood. So the team thanked her with an autographed sweatshirt. You're pretty proud of this sweatshirt, aren't you? I am, I'm very proud of it. This is my blood donating sweatshirt. Winning Sharks tickets would be nice, but ask the people who came here today, and most will tell you there's a more important goal in mind. In San Jose, John Ramos, KPIX 5. And the blood collected at the event today will be shared locally by hospitals affiliated with Stanford Medicine.